Welcome to our channel. Today we're diving into the top 10 common myths that can lead startup founders astray and ultimately to failure. These myths, they're landmines disguised as opportunities. Let's debunk these myths together. This is the biggest load of crap entrepreneurs tell themselves. You think just because you built something awesome, everyone's gonna line up. Remember Segway? Revolutionary product, right? Total flop. Why? Because they forgot to tell people why they needed it. No marketing, no education, no connection. You need to hustle, get loud, and sell the hell out of your product. Don't be afraid to be scrappy, get creative, and hustle harder than anyone else. Look, I'm all about investing in your dreams, but this obsession with massive funding rounds right out of the gate? It's insane. Basecamp, a hugely successful project management tool, bootstrap their way to the top. Start small, prove your concept, and let your success speak for itself. When you have traction, the investors will come knocking. Remember Quirky? They thought they had the magic touch, a crowdsourcing platform for inventions. Problem was, they were so busy building a platform for ideas, they forgot about the most important thing market demand. Validate your idea before you go all in. Talk to your target audience, get feedback, and make sure there's a real need for what you're building. Don't fall in love with the solution, fall in love with the problem you're solving. First mover advantage doesn't guarantee anything. Being first to market doesn't mean you'll win the race. Remember Friendster? the OG social network. They had the lead, the users, the momentum. Then MySpace came along and then Facebook. Being first means nothing if you can't adapt, innovate and keep your users engaged. Stay agile, listen to your customers and never stop iterating. More features does not equal more success. Ever heard of Google Wave? Probably not. Google poured tons of resources into this revolutionary communication tool. Problem was, it was so overloaded with features, nobody understood how to use it. Focus on building a product that solves a specific problem in the simplest, most elegant way possible. Flexibility is key, your business plan isn't set in stone. Here's the thing about plans, they change. The best entrepreneurs are adaptable, willing to pivot when necessary. Look at Flickr. They started as an online game. Don't be afraid to iterate, to adjust your course based on market feedback and your own learnings. Be open to that. Competition is a good thing. Too many entrepreneurs see competition as a threat, but you know what? It's a gift. It pushes you to be better, to innovate, to fight for every customer. Look at Slack. They entered a crowded market dominated by Microsoft Teams and others. Embrace competition, let it fuel your fire. Use it as an opportunity to learn, to grow, and to differentiate yourself. Perfection is the enemy of progress. Listen to Reid Hoffman, the guy who built LinkedIn. If you are not embarrassed by the first version of your product, you've launched too late. Get your product out there, get feedback, and iterate. The market will tell you what works and what doesn't, so ship it. A great idea is just the beginning. Ideas are cheap. Execution is everything. Webvan, the online grocery delivery service, had a brilliant idea, years ahead of its time, but they failed miserably because of poor execution. Don't underestimate the importance of execution. You need to assemble the right team, build a solid infrastructure, and deliver on your promises. Growth at all costs? Think again? We work. Remember them? They were the darlings of the startup world, raising billions on the promise of disrupting the office space. Problem was, their entire model was built on unsustainable growth. They expanded too quickly, burned through cash, and ultimately imploded. Don't chase growth for growth's sake. Focus on building a sustainable business with a solid foundation. Outrow busting myths, building success. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more insights into the startup world. Building a successful startup is hard work. It's about hustle, resilience, and a willingness to learn and adapt. Go out there, break the mold, and crush it. See you next time.